City versus Liverpool Academy. Can I say that? Of course I can say that because Liverpool played with all their academy players, you know, kids were there, you know, especially in the after, you know, from 87th minute, you know, but before I rush to 87th minute, let's talk about the game. The game, you know, Liverpool looked the better of the two teams, even though they had 11 players injured after you, after you include that uh, Caicedo injury, uh, injury that Caicedo made her, made what she called uh, Gravenbach to have it in the 28th minute. You know what? I was so devastated that he did not get yellow card, he did not get red card. But the explanation that the VR room or whatever the referee department gave that was that the player did it unintentionally. Uh, but on the other side, Curtis Jones was trying to win the ball and he stepped the ball, then he bounced and he touched the other player and he was red carded. So where is the consistency? Uh, it was a big game, as Mauricio Pochettino said. Uh, we really need the referees to show up, but I don't think the ref even woke up. He still he was still at his place with his kids and wife because that game there was no ref officiating. I don't know how Kaysedo finished that game with no yellow card or no anything. Uh, I don't think uh, Konate should have a yellow card. I don't think so. Um, if Konate was to have a yellow card, why does Kaisedo did not get one? You know, those things are the question you ask yourself. Uh, leaving the referee aside, uh, Liverpool players really played well, uh, especially Van Dijk, uh, McAllister and Endo. You know, Endo was running even though it was 118th minute. He was still putting the efforts that he started the game with. And, you know, like sometimes you really, really, really uh, need to have such players for your team so that you know your team can be successful and even though you know people were and were you know so quick to charge oh he's an old man he's old what yes he's 30 years old but he's better than the endo uh, the henderson that we repl he replaced and the fabinho he replaced fabinho was playing like a 97 year old even though he was 20 something you know and you know like now that whenever, like, let's say a full squad is there, you know, I really think we have one of the best midfielders. If, let's say, you put there Thiago, McAllister, and Soboslai, we can give Manchester City a run for their money, you know. But is that going to happen? No. So the game was really good. Like, I really enjoyed every bit of minute. Like, there's some small things that, you know, they need to improve, but, you know, Liverpool, you know, pick up to everyone. Uh, on the other side, when I see Chelsea midfielders, you know, they're dead. Other than Gallagher, they're dead. Like, Chelsea football team has no midfielders. Cole Palmer, who, is a, who was playing at the right wing, should be playing, you know, attacking midfielder. And they should get to holding midfielders. Caicedo is a fraud. And uh, so... Yeah, uh, another thing that I want to say is that that, that will never be mentioned, be, will be never mentioned by other play, mm, YouTubers or other post-match previewers, is that the goal that we scored wouldn't have happened if Bobby Clark wouldn't have shot that ball. The kid was trying to make different. He was actually better than all Chelsea midfielders. Bobby Clark was better than all Chelsea midfielders. And if he wouldn't have shot the ball that he that they got, we scored. If the ball he wouldn't shot, we wouldn't have scored the goal. Because other players were trying to cycle and find a better opportunity, but he just went for it, you know. So yeah, um, that's my post-match preview. I also say want to say something. Your game club, you don't have to stop, you know, the Amfist celebration after the game. No, let's say whatever, whoever wants to have issues, I have issue with it. You don't have to care about it because we enjoy as fans. You know, we always, that's the most attaching part of the game. And, you know, especially since now you're living, we will enjoy it every second of it. And, you know, all, we, we whichever cup we win is for you. I'm happy, as I said in my preview uh, match uh, reaction, that I really want us to win all the cups for him. And I still believe the same. So you guys, take care. 
and let me know what you guys think about the game how you guys feel the game and everything and i will see you in the next video so yeah peace